Hello everybody. Today we'll discuss another neurological case which is uh, which has a very unique finding. Now I want you to observe this MRI image. This is a MRI coronal image with us. This is coronal T2 T1 weighted image. I want you to take a look at it carefully. This is the ventricle, ventricle, gray matter, white matter, white matter, gray matter. What do you see? Is there any finding? Now if you take a careful look, you will see a gray matter lined a gray matter line cleft extending from the pile surface to the ependymal surface. So what we see is a we see a closed cleft extending from the ventricular wall, which is the ependymal surface, to the epi to the pile surface. This gray matter lined pile ependymal cleft has been called as closed lip schizencephaly. What is schizencephaly? It is a type of a uh, uh, cortical malformation which has been believed to be due to abnormal neuronal migration and uh, various other theories have also been placed but most commonly accepted theory is this is abnormal neuronal migration in which you see a gray matter lined cleft extending from the pile surface to the ependymal surface. This schizencephaly can be closed lip like we see in the image above or it can be open lip in which you will see CSF filled cavity which is lined by gray matter on both sides. So you will see gray matter lined cortical dysplasia oh. cleft, gray matter lined cleft which is filled up with CSF. This is open lips schizencephaly which you may see bilateral as well. You may see on both sides. So schizencephaly has been divided into open lip and closed lip type. Usually the closed lip type is more difficult to diagnose on MRI. MRI is the imaging of choice for this abnormality. Thank you.